While tourists flock to Cape Town and Johannesburg, South Africa's third largest city, Durban, is often forgotten, unjustly since this oceanfront metropolis is a unique blend of Indian, Zulu and European influences. I asked taxi driver Musa Kaji to show me his Durban. We are currently in Clearwood, which is uh, an original Indian settlement area and we are right now standing at one of the oldest taxi ranks in Durban, South Africa. These taxis tra transport uh, people from the here to the fruit and veg market and to the Clearwood station and various other areas within this place. We are now going to the Victoria Street Market, which is historically speaking plus minus 150 years old. It's been refurbished and uh, you're going to see Zulus and uh, Indian cultures and a blend of both. <laughs> All the various garlands, wedding, funeral, engagement. This is a spear that was designed by the Zulu king, Shaka Zulu. It's much shorter than the original spears that were much longer. And this was used. The Nobkiri was used in battle and the spear. Take it, step, hit, scope, skid and donut. Here we go. Rings. Worn by a Zulu. No, head rings. Am I right? This is it. You put this on your head. Put it on, on, on you. Let, you. let him see how it looks. Yeah. Good like this. Smile. Yes, you must smile. You must show how happy you are. It's what a man would wear. He would wear it in this way. And that's your traditional Zulu man. That's what? Uh, Indian on the outside and Zulu on the inside. Oh, I'm happy. Me too. We are now on our way to lunch, which is Durban lunch, unique to Durban. You won't get this anywhere else in the world. Bunny chow. Hi, how are you doing, ma'am? Fine, thank you. How are Good. you? I'm fine, ma'am. Good. Okay, give me a pot of bunny in a glass, um, extra gravy, and uh, a salad with green chilies, please. This is what a bunny chow consists of. It's a loaf of bread cut in half. You've got the crust, dug out part, which you dig out, and then you put your curry in, and your dug out either pops on the top or they leave it on the side if you're eating it. If you take away, they pop it on the top, they wrap it up, and you take it off. Without a chili, no food tastes good for me. My own family, going back six generations, came through to South Africa in 1870s to 1880s. They came from the province of Gujarat, which is in the northwest of India, a city called Surat. Party government uh, wanted to get all the Indians out of South Africa at any cost to the extent where they even incited violence on black against Indians and that resulted in the 1949 riots. They've investigated going to various other countries and leaving Indians there. Nothing materialized. We are still here. Durban, South Africa. Hola, hola, Mchita. I'm a Jan. I'm not a Zapila. Sure, see how I'm From South Beach along. 
to North Beach. Durban has um, a warm Mozambique channel which keeps the water warm, temperate. You can swim 365 days a year. Another day in the life of a taxi driver. This is where I come to chill out and spend some time strolling on the beach, take a walk on the pier, enjoy the sea breeze and de-stress.